people uh, asking about it. Save like congratulations on that win. And uh, considering you had a nice tweet yesterday, show us your tomfoolery and goofiness. What do you mean? You can't force it like that. It's you know, it has to happen naturally. As you can see, <laughs> I am standing right now, so that's already very, uh, very much uh, a lot of tomfoolery already. How are you guys? I am doing fine. How are you? I'm doing very good. After that, uh, I mean, it looked like it was over after five minutes, but that game was uh, still a very interesting one to see. Indeed, it was quite easy. After I destroyed Ramses and Lane, the game was super simple. <laughs> this guy, I felt like he was tilted since minute two. So, yeah, a lot of fun. Well, you kept high-fiving him. Obviously, he's going to be tilted every single time you kill him. Yeah, it's the, it's the mental damage. I mean, were you surprised that the lane actually went that well for you uh, against the Enchantress and anti -Mitch? uh well i think if if i got a wolf creep i would have i would have destroyed him even more but unlucky no wolf creep but uh uh i think it's like a skill issue so it it won't be well <laughs> okay <laughs> uh yeah i mean you took a spot in that roster obviously for a reason you, you just showed him exactly why and uh, nonetheless uh you know you guys let and Terry Stackies to uh, through. You won the game, obviously. But uh, what what are your thoughts on playing such a game that is completely different compared to like any other Dota matchup that you have? Uh, it's just you know classic classic Techies Dota. He's just sitting in his base, you know, clicking mines. Luckily, I was playing Doom, so I didn't really care much. I was eating creeps, you know. I have Midas as well. My farm rate was insane this game. I'm farming my uh, my GPM for the stats, so I was very happy that we can just sit around and hit some creeps, you know. If they want to play 70 minute games just for fun, then that's fine by me. Yeah, I was also wondering, like, how has the team, like, find it, you know, playing with Mikey uh, compared to Abed, you know? Uh, what do you feel like are the main differences playing with Mikey uh, compared to Abed? Um, well, different. I think they have uh, slightly different hero pools. They, I think, I mean, it's also like we, this team has been playing with Abed for quite some time, so they, they know what to, like, expect of him and stuff like that. Whereas Mikey is much more of a, of a wild card. And I think they both they both are kind of silent, but Mikey he, he I don't know they they actually feel very similar. These two players are very similar. So maybe that's why we're doing so good because like I think Mikey fits us pretty well. I think he's like uh, yeah he's very similar to Abed. All right, good to know. Uh, yeah, uh, of course there was also a game one, and we had obviously a bit of a discussion about uh, specific item choices but that last fight where ty jumps over the river dies two supports try to help him die your team dives into the enemy's base they get all the kills like that ending was so incredibly fast we had no idea what to think of it what, what were your thoughts at the ending of that game mm. Yeah, well, uh, we were like, okay, guys, let's go smoke. And then uh, we smoked, and then tied blinking in. into the five of us. And, you know, uh, it, it just kind of snowballed from there. Arthur just really wanted to dive them. So he just went into their base. I was like, I can't help you there, buddy. He was like, no need. I'm just going to smash them alone. <laughs> <laughs> and smashing, they indeed did. Uh, you guys advancing on towards the next stage, even with a sub, as you mentioned, obviously a very good sub. I mean, he's been incredibly impressive so far in the Dream League tournament, and uh, you guys have been looking uh, really good as well, not losing a single series in that regard. Um, yeah, any last questions, Winter? Uh, no, I, I'm good. He's yeah. good. Uh, any last remarks, any words for the viewers at home? Thanks, guys. See you. <laughs> <laughs> See you indeed, save a light. Uh, great interview.